Brainy Dose presents 10 Little Habits That Reveal Your True Personality There are a number of small habits you practice every day without ever giving them a second thought. And even though you don't consciously think about how you pick up your bag, place the toilet paper roll, or write emails, little actions can be very revealing. These seemingly insignificant actions actually carry a lot of weight. Based on expert opinion and psychological research, they can provide meaningful insight into your emotions, your personality traits, and the way you approach life in general. Who knew something so small could be so deep? Let's find out what your little habits might reveal about you. Number 1. Your Eating Habits Behavior experts and psychologists agree that your eating habits can divulge a lot of information about your personality. For example, if you eat slowly, you're more likely to be confident, composed, and in control. If you tend to shovel food in your mouth and eat quickly, you're more likely to be hot-headed. On the flip side, you're probably also goal-oriented and ambitious. Adventurous eaters tend to be pushy or curious risk-takers, while picky eaters are known to be anxious or neurotic and pay attention to the finer details. If you like to keep your food separate, you're probably cautious and stubborn. Number 2. Shopping Habits It might surprise you to know that your shopping habits can be just as revealing as your eating habits. In general, there are two kinds of shoppers, those who prefer lists and those who shop more spontaneously. If you like lists, you're more likely practical and budget conscious, as well as meticulous. If you tend to buy things because they're in front of you, you're probably impulsive by nature, and window shopping can be dangerous. When you shop, how much information do you need before you buy something? If you like to read all the labels, you might be detail-oriented and a bit obsessive. Number 3. Your Selfie Style Social media can reveal a lot about a person, and how you take selfies says more than you think. Research found that those with an agreeable nature tend to take selfies from a lower angle. Those who reveal less of the background are the conscientious types. If you often post selfies with positive energy like a big smile or laughter, you're probably open to new experiences, while the classic duck lips reveal neurotic tendencies. Number 4. Your Handwriting Graphologists, the experts who study handwriting, can predict your personality pretty accurately based on the characteristics and patterns of your handwriting. Large letters indicate someone who is social and seeks attention. Small letters are more often written by focused, introverted types. Writing that slants to the right shows that someone is friendly and sentimental, but also impulsive. In contrast, a leftward slant indicates that the person is independent and reserved. If there is no slant at all, the individual is most likely logical and realistic. If you write with heavy pressure, you probably experience strong feelings and react quickly in emotional situations. On the other hand, light pressure reveals that you are easygoing and empathetic, but may lack energy. Finally, rounded letters show a creative, artistic personality, while sharp letters indicate a curious, intelligent, aggressive, and often intense nature. Number 5. The way you carry a bag even the way you carry your bag can reveal your personality, according to body language experts. For example, if you wear a backpack, you're probably the independent type. Someone who wears a bag with the strap across their body prioritizes protection and practicality, while allowing a bag to rest behind you shows that you're relaxed and confident. If you carry your bag in your hand, you're probably assertive, organized, and efficient. Oh, and high-maintenance people who prioritize social status tend to carry their bags in the crook of their arms. Number 6. The way you wash your body This may have never crossed your mind, but the order in which you wash your body parts can expose your personality. According to studies, those who wash their feet first tend to make terrible partners and give up when presented with a difficult situation. They're often unable to think outside the box or challenge themselves, no matter how badly they want to. If you start with your shoulders, you're probably a loner who cares a lot about power and money. And if you scrub your chest first, you're most likely a straightforward and rational person. Those who start with their armpits tend to be strong and hardworking people who depend on others when they need to. Who knew some suds could be so revealing? Number 7. The way you place a toilet paper roll Everyone can be grouped into one of two categories. Those who put the toilet paper roll over and those who put it under. 
It might seem overgeneralized or incredibly insignificant at first, but research says otherwise. People who prefer their toilet paper over tend to be more dominant, while those who prefer it under tend to be more submissive, and that goes for both personal and professional relationships. Number 8. Your email style. Studies have shown an immense correlation between how we speak in real life and how we write emails, so much so that our emails can reveal a lot about who we are. For example, narcissists tend to use first-person language, like me, I, my, and mine a lot. Extroverts like to use casual tones and tend to talk about fun activities, interests, or gatherings. But how you say something can be just as important as what you say. No typos means that you're mindful, a perfectionist, or even obsessive, while bad grammar could expose lower levels of IQ and academic intelligence. A long email can show that you have a lot of energy and are very thorough, but it can also communicate that you're needy. Number 9. Nervous Ticks Body-focused repetitive behaviors like biting your nails or picking at your skin also reveal a lot about you. Studies show that these nervous tics tend to occur in people who feel frustrated, bored, or even relaxed. Those who engage in repetitive behaviors like hair tugging or foot tapping are likely perfectionists who are subconsciously trying to soothe their dissatisfaction. And these behaviors are usually comforting for those who feel bored or irritated. Number 10. How punctual you are. Are you someone who tends to arrive last minute or late to everything? Your tardiness can signal that you're a laid-back person, lack confidence, and that you're unreliable. Do you like to be early for everything? Then you might be a bit neurotic. If you need to know all the details and be able to account for any obstacle, you're probably the nervous type. Right in the sweet spot, you'll find those who arrive on time. They are neither anxious nor careless and tend to feel comfortable in almost any situation. Punctual individuals are often well-prepared and open to challenges. Keep in mind that these personality indicators aren't always 100% accurate. These are general findings and may not apply to you specifically. They're meant to be a starting point to analyze and reflect on your habits and tendencies. After all, no one knows you better than you. What do you think about this list? Did you learn anything new about yourself or about someone in your life? Share your thoughts and comments below. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends so we can keep making them. For more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and remember to click on the notification bell. Also, be sure to check out our other videos as well. Thanks for watching.